Hello friends, welcome to my new series. Let's begin with the very basis of physiology, homeostasis. Homeostasis is about maintaining the body's internal environment so that it is stable and works efficiently. A body has around 100 trillion cells and their metabolisms must harmonize for normal functioning. As external and internal conditions keep changing, our body keeps adjusting to maintain homeostasis by various adaptive mechanisms like to maintain body fluid composition, constant thirst, renal activity, hormones, etc. are crucial. Several external and internal factors affect homeostasis and our body system has amazing capability of adjusting to maintain important parameters like blood pressure, temperature, breathing, heart rate, etc. Two feedback systems function in harmony to achieve homeostasis. Positive feedback is like a play switch to start the process which amplifies the change so the response is very fast. Like when we cut our finger, the blood clotting is initiated and promoted. Negative feedback system is like fine tuning or stop and reverses the initial change. For example, body may instruct to stop synthesizing a new hormone or enzyme as it's no more required and excess may cause harm. Or like in thermal regulation, heat raises body temperature and skin receptors and hypothalamus sense this and brain induces sweating. Our lifestyle choices, environmental exposures and diseases affect homeostasis. A diet lacking specific vitamin or mineral affect homeostasis like iron deficiency will cause anemia. Bacterial toxins, pesticides, insecticides, drug overdose, etc. and certain genetic changes in our cells interfere with homeostasis causing diseases. Lack of sleep, sunlight and exercise. And also our thoughts and emotions can cause harmful chemical changes in our bodies. Like lack of sleep causes irregular cardiac rhythms, fatigue, anxiety and headaches. To maintain homeostasis, our bodies try to remove negative health influences and self-regulate and repair. Thank you. If you like this video, please like and subscribe to my channel to motivate me further. See you next time.